like, hello everybody, what's your whole universe? I hope that everything is fine and I'm a Russian man who brings value through my own experiences and today we're gonna talk about the inner motivation, the inner stimulus that I have inside of me that says to me, Igor, do this, do that, do those, do this, or something like this. It is rhyme skills, wow, three rhymes in a row, <laughs> applause, and let's talk. My own motivation is a manic pixie dream girl. Who is she? What the hell is going on here, you maybe can ask, and I will tell you, the Manic Pixie, a Manic or the Manic Pixie Dream Girl is a character, archetype of books, maybe movies, or cartoons, or anime, or maybe picture art. Mona Lisa is a Manic Pixie Dream Girl that was drawn before. Yes, you understand it. Mona Lisa is something imaginable that Jesus Christ is so beautiful, it's amazing. And also we have the definition of what uh, the, a Manic Pixie Dream Boy. It is the boy that uh, people are going forward. Right now I will use something maybe not super understandable for old people for I don't want to say old people I want to say the older generation that was born in uh, 1950 1960 1970 or something because Robert Pattinson if you are not familiar who is he is a Hollywood star who played in a movie Twilight the main character and I, I can show you pictures because maybe you don't know who is he one moment Robert Pattinson I need to Pattinson one moment, I will open it on my phone. Robert Pat Robert Pattinson. Yes, it is uh, the a manic pixie dream boy. It is kind of a boy who girls want to see. Always look. It is this type of face, and uh, he played. Uh, um, Edward, uh, I don't know who, uh, some character from movie. Also, we can say a uh, flying. Flying, f I don't know who is, it's a uh, fairy, flying fairy from Peter Pan. She is a manic pixie dream girl, she is uh, nice and good, it is from Carton. Uh, the donkey from Shrek, it is pixie dream animal, I don't know what, it is kind of supportive and nice imaginable friend that's super nice and chill and you can hang out with him and have a communication with him and he does nice jokes and maybe sometimes silly but they are funny. And also a manic pixie dream girl, it is if you've seen movie, it is new movie, it is Pilgrim versus the world, it is uh, the movie about the boy who was in love with a girl and the girl was called Romana Flowers, Romana Flowers, and uh, he loved her so much and she was kind of with uh, dyed, uh, dyed hair, with some glasses, with a specific style of music that she loved, specific style of interests and something really like from not our earth, yes? And uh, people like something that not from our earth and what what friendly to them. You understand? You love something new when it is friendly. Yes, it is uh, everything about our life. When someone f is friendly to you and he speaks about something unnatural and something like new, you think that, oh, nice, amazing, good and uh, interesting. You kind of interact with your imagination, but uh, in real life. And uh, Manic Pixie Dream Girl is an idealized type of girl. Also, if you've seen with Jim Carrey movie Eternal Sunshine of Mind or something, you can see Clementine from it. You can google Manic Pixie Dream Girl and maybe you will find your own type of Manic Pixie Dream Girl that you know. And in literature you can find them. In in uh, literature The Fault in Our Stars we have the book from John Green and uh, he wrote about Augustus. Augustus who is a manic pixie dream boy, who is so nice, good and uh, really a, respons uh, I, I, a responsible reply, I don't know how to say it correct, the person who is always uh, ready to support you and uh, something with really awkward maybe interest but nice. And uh, about my motivation, I'm motivated by doing things for this idealized thing, idealized girl. And who 
I, it is it is doesn't it doesn't exist in real life sometimes maybe yes maybe not I did not see but I can apply it for real people it is uh, not uh, the approach for everybody because uh, for someone it will be hard because Jesus idealizing and then you see the real world and you are kind of escaping the real world it is maybe not for sound but for me it works I will tell you what works for me I have for example, a girl in uh, real life, and I do kind of idealizing her in some things, and I raise her uh, in in my point of view. For example, she is a drummer, and I think that she is like a Travis Bark, or maybe someone who is uh, really nice in, on drums from U2, or maybe from Stere uh, I mean Stere uh, Led Zeppelin drummer, or maybe some Oasis drummer, or another drummer from different bands. Yes, we can imagine that it is super nice, or maybe she is a pianist, but I imagine that it is a list near me, and uh, I imagine I idealize it, and it makes me really nice and. I want to strive myself to go forward because I want to be like this person and uh, it is a kind of interesting approach maybe it is not real maybe it is illusional but it makes me kind of happy because I can go to this uh, and it makes me motivated to do things when our goal to be motivated to do things it is really nice approach because I can imagine that I will be this with this cool girl and it will be good or maybe if I will not be then I can imagine that maybe someone exists uh, with this uh, type of skills and I want to be with uh, this girl I, I hope that you understand uh, with this girl to to I don't want to say I don't know how to say it in English соответствовать in Russian language it means uh, one moment I will translate it соответствовать it is when you one moment. So it is uh, the translating right now. Uh, correspond match match. Yes, I think that this match to match to this uh, to this girl to match to this uh, to this idealized idol that I have inside of me. And uh, it works for everything. And I remember how I was learning dancing because I wanted to be with a girl. And uh, I was learning it because, Jesus, I want to be with her. And uh, it was a motivation for me. And also motivation to learn uh, singing skills because I wanted to sing a song for her. And also writing, writing different styles of books, writing poetry. It is sometimes for someone. And it is... For me, really nice when I start a book with dedication for sound. Dedication, I hope that I used this form correct. Dedication it is when I use this tool as a gift for someone. And uh, the shooting video is a good tool for me because I imagine that someone maybe will watch it. Ryan, maybe Sterling Moss, maybe someone else from Russia will watch it. Artem Garros also, maybe someone else uh, who is from different countries. Maybe it will be seen by Indian person or someone. And it is a really good tool because uh, I can I can speak about these things uh, during my walk inside of the room, like walking and talking with myself. But also I can talk with camera and I know that it will be maybe useful for someone and I will be and I like to be useful and uh, yes maybe that's why I want to go to the level of uh, pixie dream girl because I motivated by love to her and I want to be with her and it means that uh, I should match to her level and if I need to match to her level to bring to her value to be useful then I should be on her level it is kind of my thoughts about it. Yes, I can bring value even on le on low level because I can say in a view of uh, in a view of consumer maybe your art, but I prefer also to speak in this level and think in this and in this type of mindset. Okay, and I hope you understand right now, and uh, that's why I al always learn English uh, language too, and uh, maybe 
uh, also I wanted to go to America to be with American girls and right now I found because I thought that American girls they are uh, I excuse me excuse me for it previously I thought that American girls are are prettier than UK girls but now I found a girl from UK she's from Island White Island white and she is nice and uh, attractive and uh, it uh, broke my stereotype. It means that it is in the future right now. In the future, not uh, not here, not here. It is utilized this uh, th not really nice thoughts of Igor. And uh, right now I understand that uh, girls uh, from UK we can find beautiful girls in UK. We can find in any part of the world. And I was not really watching at the big picture of our world and I understand that in any kind country will be pretty girls and uh, people who I can uh, idealize in this way and uh, I found uh, one girl she's name is princess uh, <laughs> they uh, uh, said said and for me uh, firstly I thought that said it is kind of maybe uh, it is not real name but it is real said I thought that is always sad and something but said is a real name and she's name is said and she's uh, from Ireland uh, white and uh, she was born in August and uh, also, I don't know anything. I, I've seen her videos. She was... Uh, I found her on TikTok. I don't prefer to use TikTok to, like, entertain myself. I don't do entertaining stuff uh, so much. I was scrolling it uh, in finding the band member. Because I needed a band member for playing drums, to play piano, to sing together, to do rehearsing. And I found this girl scrolling, scrolling, scrolling. Oh, I found her. Wow, she's beautiful. And I tapped and she's from UK. And after that, I wrote her on Instagram. Maybe we will have a communication. I hope so. I recorded three voice messages to her and I hope that she will not block me. Because uh, it is kind of... I don't want to say that it is love, but maybe yes, M yes, 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 it is a good feeling, maybe it is love feeling. When I feel kind of really flying and really uh, super inside, uh, like I'm going forward, so then I think that it's kind of love. And uh, I will communicate with her and maybe my goal will be to move uh, to move to UK in uh, maybe in two months, three months, four months, fifth, m five months. It all depends on my ambitions and ambitions and on borders that are closed or opened. Ambitions in a way of uh, that I will create uh, income, income uh, pa uh, not passive but active. I mean that need to to write more books to bring more value to people who read me and it means uh, that uh, they will pay for it for they it will be their words of uh, saying thank you and it means that uh, i will grow my income and then it uh, will be my opportunity to move to uk maybe to ireland white and to communicate with her if she will be able to communicate with me and if she will uh, would like to communicate because sometimes it looks really stalkering or maybe creeping on someone or maybe a try tribing try i i don't know it's a synonym of different synonyms of word stalking and uh, okay it is what i wanted to say that uh, maybe next videos I will learn more about UK because of this fact, because uh, it is my own motivation. Why was I doing videos about America? Because I wanted to to be with uh, an American girl, firstly. And uh, now uh, I have motivation also for UK and uh, I have uh, my inner like love to these things because I found love in uh, loving loving people. When I love people, then I love the subject that these people talk to. Yes, and now I have more of this motivation inside of me. I It doesn't mean that if you watched me before from South Africa and uh, you wrote me comments, it doesn't mean that I don't love you or something. No, it doesn't mean so. It means that uh, I have more. I had more motivation to go to US firstly, because I had more kind of associations inside of me and I was focused on it. Everybody has uh, 24 hours in our life and now I will focus more on UK. And uh, you can expect from me to see more videos about UK, learning me about maybe things in UK, laws and uh, how to move to UK and uh, things of this nature.
So thank you so much for watching this video. You can leave in the comment section below maybe different accents from uh, UK that you know. Maybe it will be useful and I will... Yes, it will be useful and um, I maybe will learn something new and I will Google how to learn this, those, this and uh, then I will move forward and we will move forward because uh, you you have usefulness of your advices and I have usefulness of my doings and we have win-win situation it is amazing thank you thank you a lot for watching have a wonderful day a week maybe a year month decade uh, century in your life everything will be fine see you next time be cool in Brussels bye bye